Hey, this is Brett Johnson with Realty Network Group at Realty Executives. Are you looking to sell a home? At times, it may seem like you are adrift on an endless sea of paperwork. So many documents are required during the sale of a home that it can be confusing and worrisome. It's easy to become overwhelmed, which is why I've put together this brief primer to help you navigate the process. Now, this isn't an exhaustive list of all the documents that you might need during the sale, but it should help you to get the ball rolling. So the first would be what we call pre-listing paperwork. This is possibly the most paperwork intensive portion of the process. Simply put, this is when you need to gather all of the documentation for your ownership of the property and any changes you may have made. This might include things like your title or deed, receipts, and any documents for recent improvements, warranties, and other information regarding the appliances and any records related to an HOA or other agreements. The disclosures and documentation required by a seller can vary widely depending on your specific situation and location. So be sure to connect with a trusted local real estate agent like me to help you with gathering these documents. The second is gonna be the listing paperwork. This is a lot easier for the homeowner. This will include things like a title check, disclosure paperwork, and a listing agreement. Much of this paperwork should have been gathered during the listing, and some of it will be the responsibility of the real estate agent. It's important that you work closely with your agent to make sure that you have all the necessary documents. And the last is gonna be the offer and closing paperwork. This is another step in the process that is heavy on documentation. Much of it will be included in the steps prior, but you should also need to look for things like purchase offer, appraisals, and inspections. Part of this paperwork you'll already have, another part you'll receive during the selling process, and other parts will actually be generated by your real estate agent and the mortgage companies. The most important things you'll want to have on hand during the process are your identification and deed for the property. If you have any other questions about what documentation or steps in the process to sell your home, please do not hesitate to reach out to me. You can reach me at 602-502-6468. Thanks again for watching.